I'm going to show you how to use our protractors to measure an angle or mock up an angle on a tube. So we're going to choose 35 degrees. So what you'll see is on the right hand side you'll see a minus sign on the acrylic etched and on the left hand side you'll see a plus. And on one side of the protractor it's 0 to 90, on the other it's 90 to 180. So what you'll do is starting with the 0 to 90 side, if we were to do a 35 degree angle, that would be in this area. You'll see the four tick marks on the right hand side and the four tick marks on the left hand side. So when you push this side, you're going to allow it to bottom out on the other side and push it around. You're going to keep pushing until you get to 30 in the center. You'll see that long tick will match up with 30 degrees. That is 30 degrees, and so you're going to go plus 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, and you'll see 35 degrees right there. So what you'll have is 30, a 35 degree angle um, mocked up, and if you wanted to do greater than, 100, uh, greater than 90, you're going to push it all the way around until it bottoms out, and you'll have 90 degrees, and then you're going to flip over the protractor, and do a similar operation on the other side, you're just going to take this and push it around. So 90, make sure this back side is bottomed out the whole time. It's going to be bottomed out on 90 degrees. And you're going to push, push this around until you get to, let's say, 135 degrees. So you're at 130 right there. You're going to keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing until you get to 135, which will put that tick mark right in the center and those other ticks will line up with those other lines.